Okay guys, you may notice something different now. <laughs> I've got a uh, input on. So hopefully you'll be able to see uh, basically what I'm pressing, how long I'm charging for most importantly. Like maybe it'll help you like see as soon as soon as I jump up I'm charging now, etc. Anyway, on this um, on this tutorial I'm just gonna show kind of wake up possibilities from a knockdown. Um, he's got so many, so even if I tell you all my little tricks, you're never going to be able to, you know, know every single one and know exactly which one he's going to use. Um, I showed you these. Oh wait, I'm going to use this combo as an example, and I showed you the um, the double reverse. I showed you the head stomp, and I showed you the, the ex double reverse. But I didn't show you <laughs> what well, it's basically a reset mix-up is what I'd call it. It's um, basically that. Oh, basically that. Do you see how it looks like I'm going for a head stomp? But then no, I'm not. It's 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 a pretty. It can catch people off guard. Let's just say that. And I'm gonna I'm gonna show you uh, mix-ups from that. So um, I'll show you a basic one first basically straight to throw because as I say as I said um, on the last vid that sometimes they'll focus thinking you're gonna um, you know hit them with that because if they do focus that they can hit you like, if they focus that they will hit you and it could get all you could do anything basically you're at his mercy so if you do actually um, just do that grab them out of focus sorted but let's let's put a situation down in round one I did that I grabbed him. So round two, I'm in the same situation. He's knocked down. He's going to think I'm going to grab. Okay? But you can also mix it up with loads of different things. This is one of a Straight away, you've got the... Um, if, if you hit this at the right time, he, he won't grab you. So that that's another situation. And also from that, it's another knockdown. So from showing you just from one knockdown to a mix-up got another knockdown. You see what I mean? I just love Bison because of this. It's His, his mix-ups are... Right. When Bison's in your head and when, when you're mentally broken, he fucks you up. He totally fucks you up. Because he... You have to guess everything he's going to do. And if you're not guessing right, he's going to take so much damage off you. Like, let, let's see. If, if you do the... Oh. If you do... Right, that's... Anyway, 322. 322, 120... 440-ish. 439. Let's say 440. Okay. That's 440 from um, a wrongly guessed mix-up. That's pretty amazing. That's nearly half health. And it doesn't end there. Look at that, oh my god. Like, that's, that's, what is that? That's one combo, let's look. One combo, reset, mix up, missed it, but whatever. And then the um, Psycho Crusher, it's hard to really play in a talk, to be honest. Uh, the Psycho Crusher is um, another mix up reset. Bloody hell, so that's it. So you've reset the combo two times, that's why you're getting so much. And by the way, that's. Uh, 540 damage if that all hits. That's half health. No EX used. Half health. Come on, you have to you have to respect Bison for that, fucking hell. But the thing about Bison is he doesn't hit that hard compared to others, so you do need these resets and these mix ups. But again, that's why I love him. Just totally in, in the head. Fuck him, you know, fuck him up. Um um, this guy, Psycho Power, I think his name is, commented on uh, one of my videos saying about how I was showing. Wait, what am I doing? How, how I was just showing this version of the counter hit. How that's. Uh, but there's also another version, which is. It's harder to pull off and it's usually better to do it from an FADC, but usually when you do do. Um, uh, what they call frame traps, they are from FADCs because it's to catch the mashing. Um, but it's this one. And that can put you. Wait, no, that, no, that, no, that one. Wait, 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 wait. It needs to say free, free combo thing. Yeah. Okay, 
now. Oh, wrong one. It, well, yeah, you can do that one, but I, I just like using the Psycho Crush because there's more damage and it gets you into the mix-up possibilities. As I said on the last video, doing that gets you into the pressure, you know, where you can do loads of shit. The, the, you know, the, 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 in the corner, whatever. But the Psycho Crusher gets you into this position, what I've told you, which I, I like more. Um, it is more risky, though. And don't just use this. That's the thing. This is how I play, basically, right? Say one round, I'm doing this all the time. Not just jumping in, but, you know, I'm doing scissors a lot. I'm, I'm doing this. I'm keeping them in the corner. Keep, I'm keeping doing this. You know, I keep doing that, whatever. They're in the corner. But... Let's see on the next round, they're thinking, right, he's going to be start doing that. You're going to totally fuck their head by going, they're not going to be ready for a jump in throw or whatever you're going to do. They're not going to be ready for that. They're thinking, shit, is going to get it took me back to the scissors pressure. So it's good to mix up your play. That's what I do. I don't think it's good playing the exact same every single round because they're going to catch on. Um, but yeah, I want to I actually show this mix up with this Psycho Crusher. Is that it? Yes! Nice. <laughs> Free hit. Uh, 302 damage, which is pretty nice. Um, let's say you went for... Wait, that's going to be about 300 damage, okay. I meant to do a cycle. Oh, wait, this is really... I'm going to put all the calculations um, after I've done the video because I'll be able to pause it because I can't work this out this fast while playing as and looking at the numbers. The wrong one, whoops. Let's, let's just try this again. It's uh... Let's see. Here. Wow, I can't focus. Um, FAD2 all of a sudden. Oh, I hit him from the front. But yeah, I'll, I'll have a look at the damage of that. It is, um, it's gonna be classed as a counter hit damage though, which does more. But, um... Yeah, oh well. But uh, yeah, that, that's another basically. Um, you can. Uh, it's hard to charge this. See what I mean? That we're only two hits because I'm, I'm charging a bit too slow, and then the sacrifice doesn't come out when you're doing that one. You see what I mean? So it is better to do it from uh, an FADC. I, I suppose you could. Oh, actually, oh, there we go. Another mix-up. Um, you could empty jump it because you're already charging. If you look at my uh, inputs there, look, I'm charging, and as I jump, I never press forward. I do like a, a half circle backwards as I'm jumping, and then you could possibly do it. Yeah, there, yeah, there you could do it as a count here, because maybe, maybe they think, would it would it defeat a grab? That's what I'm trying to think, because it, it does have a lot of frames of lag. It does have a lot of frames starting up. Um, I don't know. I, I might try this one. I, I ain't really thought about um, doing it just from an empty jump. That's pretty easy. It is actually pretty easy. Link that. But I will, I will, that one is just beautiful in my opinion. Well, if I hit it. <laughs> there you go. Oh, it's so nice. It, it, you could reset a combo, couldn't you? Yeah, you could. You could reset a combo with this. Say, say the Dizzy. Yeah, you could reset it. Yeah, you could reset a whole combo. Hmm. See what I mean? I'm even learning things now, and I've been <laughs> I've been playing him since the God knows how long. Um, but yeah, as you've be, have you as you've seen from Wake Up, there is a lot of possibilities. And um, you could even, yeah, you could even do this if you think if great right, if you think they're gonna throw. But if they think you're going to throw, sorry, because it is Bison's game, in my opinion. When you're versus Bison, it's his game. You're the defender. You need to guess what he's going to do to win him. He's in control of the game. And that's another reason I fucking love him. But um, you could even do this. It's risky, though. They could DP to Ultra. But... See? They would have grabbed then. So, they w as I jumped then... There's enough time to come down and hit them. Um, I don't know if I can show them. Well, no, I'm not too good with the record function, especially if I'm under pressure taping and things. So I'm not going to risk it. Just imagine. Use your imagination that he's grabbing, okay? 
And um, even from this, there's a reset. Oops, damage to the X. What am I doing? Shit. I just, my mind just went blank. Right. Oh, I missed it. Wow. Right. Wow, I'm missing it now. Maybe it's got a hard charge time or something. Friggin' hell. My mind's starting to fucking go. What am I doing? Very fucking. What I wanted to show. <laughs> oh god, one more time, one more time. Okay now. What am I doing? Fucking hell. What rate? Right, basically, what I wanted to show were. Um, yeah, it was just that from from the um, what was it from? From the uh, FADC or the scissor kick? You see. Right, I'll try one more time. Oh my! Let's start. One more time where I actually get the um, the devil reverse. Wow! This always happens at the end of my vids. Oh, I got the bloody scissors! Look, look at my input. I fucking oh, whatever. I put <laughs> put punches. Um, okay. Um, basically, you saw what that were anyway. Um, so yeah, I think I've I've told you a lot of his mix-ups to be honest. Um, well, from the wake-up game. Let's think. What else could? Oh, you could uh, scissor straight away as well. Say you've um, done this one a few times. You could straight away scissor. Wait. So you can straight away scissor from it. See that? So, oh, a lot of Ryu's actually do like to. This is a, a matchup knowledge. I'm just gonna say, yeah, Matt as well as it's kind of linked. A lot of Ryu's like uh, the crouching medium, but the scissors beats crouching medium. So if you if if your Ryu's crouching medium happy, this will beat him easily. That would beat him. Like he'd crouch medium. And, yeah, that'd hit him. But um, but yeah, I'm gonna stop it here because I'm starting to get a bit mind fucked. Trying to think of like all these things. Hopefully this is a bit more organised. That's a nice little uh, mix up as well. Oops. Um, yeah, I've, I've shown you some nice things. I think uh, I've shown you the. Um... Oh, there's one more. If if they think you're going to do the crouching light kick, because uh, you've been doing it, you can reset it to a counter hit standing hard punch, like. Like that, and it will it will catch them off guard uh, again. There's there's loads of things. There's um I think you can dash and charge for it. Anyway, yeah, I'm getting off from one. I need to stop the video now. Hopefully, you've learnt more. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next vid. Hopefully, that I think I'll be doing a uh, um, crossovers and you know tricky little crossovers on the next vid. So yeah, um if you enjoyed it, rate it, etc. Cheers.